G'day viewers, I hope you're doing well. Today we've got some news from Diesel Railcar Simulator from Lapioware. Scenery Patch 14 is now live. And as usual, I read this to you to improve the accessibility of the information and in, perhaps in this case, introduce a game you may not know about. Editors. Fixed Train Editor Rails to Reload After Making Changes. Fixed Timetable Editor to Stop Test Run When Deleting Its Time Template During the Run. Fixed Route Editor Scenery View to Render Long Chain Links Correctly. Fixed Scenery View in Route Editor to Update Automatically After Moving a Terrain Node. Fixed Height for Single Points, like when moving a node that follows terrain, to match the visual terrain outside the area defined by terrain nodes. Prevented a node from rotating in the Route Editor when trying to move it by dragging. Added tooltips and changed the user interface for some terrain node preset properties for convenience. Traffic. Fixed spawning of some static formations. And the example is the Lamborn RAF Welford shunting. Fixed AI signal a problem with some reversing moves in RAF Welford shunting. Fixed AI driver issues with circular tracks. Fixed AI driver stopping at the wrong place and getting stuck at some stations. Willanuska College Doja Doa. Fixed AI driver trying to move in the wrong direction when trying to correct its wrong stopping position. Fixed some other cases of AI driver getting yeah. stuck. Visuals. Fixed culling problem for some custom models when instance rendering is active. Models would disappear too early near the camera. Fixed height mismatch between terrain and other scenery in some cases when there's a zone that affects terrain height. Disabled exhaust gas shadows because they don't display correctly on Linux. Widened service list in run menu, and miscellaneous fixed custom stereo sound distortion, optimized terrain loading. What's next? The next major update will be the gameplay update to be released in early 2025, along with smaller patches as required. And there is in fact a new Discord server for this game. So if you're not familiar with this particular game, which is Diesel Railcar Simulator, hopefully I can get to the game page from here. Can I untap into the store page? Hopefully. No, it takes me back in there. Maybe this will do it. There we go. So if you're not familiar with Diesel Railcar Simulator, it's a train simulator, and it's probably one of the best ones out there for physics. Not so much appearance, its graphics are um, getting there. They're not, not bad by any means, but they're not photorealistic or anything like that, and they don't really try to be. So... If you're into the kind of game where you can drive a train that's pretty well represented, um, has suspension like every single component in a bogey moves around, and drives like an actual train does on various routes, there's a few in the game and there's a lot in the workshop now, then um, dive in, have some fun. You'll quite appreciate this one if you know actual trains. And even if you don't know actual trains, it doesn't take long to learn to bring yourself up to the, the level needed to drive this simulator. Alrighty, enjoy folks, that's it for now, see you later. We played a game.